Telebijanel Bocha. Again, Telebijanel Bocha. What does it mean? If you notice, the word in red letter is Telebijanel. Because today, we're going to learn about the word Telebijan. Let's start. Learn Korean one word at a time, only here at Day Hangul. Word number 326. Telebijan. Again, it's Telebijan. This pronounced is a four syllable word. The first syllable is Tel, second syllable is Le, third syllable is B, and fourth is John. Telebijan. The word television actually means television. So this is just a loan word or the Korean version of television. How do we write television in Hangul? This is composed of four syllables. For the first syllable, tell, we need to draw first. A tiet character followed by an e character followed by a real character. For the second syllable, le, we need to draw first a real character followed by an e character. For the third syllable, b, we need to draw first a beep character followed by an e character. And for the last syllable, john, we need to draw first a jiet character followed by an o character followed by a nian character. So that's four syllables in all, and in order to write television in Hangul, we just need to combine all of these four syllables. Now let's try to look at this example. It says, let's watch TV, or let's watch television. The Korean translation of this is, Telebijanil Boja. Again, it's Telebijanil Boja. The Korean translation could be subdivided into two words. The first one is Telebijane. Uh, television is just TV or television. And we added er to indicate that this is the object of the sentence. And then the second part is Boja, which means let's watch. So when we combine Telebijane and Boja, it becomes Telebijane Boja, which means let's watch TV or television. So looking back to this, which is flashed a while ago at the beginning of this video, we already know by now that the meaning of the sentence Telebijanil Ocha is simply let's watch TV. And with that, you've just learned Telebijan. Now let's proceed to our previous 10 words recap. As of now, our previous 10 words are words number 316 to 325. But don't forget our word for today, word number 326, television, which means television. The first word for our review is word number 325, alta, which means to sell. Next word is kunada, which means to finish or to end. Next word for our review is palayo, which means to hurry up or to go faster. Next word is sangja. This is a noun which means box. Next word for our review is tonyo, and this is used to say absolutely not or not at all. Next is tonchoni. This is an adverb which means slowly. Next word for our review is morugesa and it means I don't know. The next word for our review is sengake. This is a present tense verb which means I think. Next word for our review is dedane which means awesome. And the last word for our review is word number 316, hengbuke, which means happy, but could also be used to say, I'm happy. Congrats! Learn Korean one word at a time, only here at Day Hangul. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to this channel for more Korean words.